it's true believers it is the third installation in hatching eggs using the nurture right 360 from harris farms and we are well we're down to three days left before hatching day so we have increased the humidity up to the 70s is between 70 and 75 percent we're using both water reservoirs i'll show you that in just a second over there and we have the chicken cam all set up so that's ready to go to hopefully we'll be able to go live and uh, do those hatchings if not, at least the camera's there to catch the action as, as it happens in the middle of the night, as those little stinkers really like to do. So let's take a look. All right, so over at the incubator, everybody's still in there. We have our chicken cam, which is just an old school uh, nest uh, drop cam. This is a uh, this is the actual nest cam, uh, uh, right, the model right after drop cam closed and nest picked them up. So it's just a basic webcam. Uh, that we're going to use to go live, hopefully, to catch those chickens hatching. And if not, at least to capture that video in the air later on, too. But as you can see, on these last few days that we have left, we can take a peek. Two days left to hatch, and they were so excited. At this point, as you can see, the humidity is way up there. It's at 72%. It is supposed to be, because in these last three days, we're using both the A and B slots to add that water and jack up the humidity in there to really make it a warm, toasty, healthy environment for those chicks to pop out of their eggs. Okay, so let's pull out that moving mechanism. We're gonna get this camera out of the way. We'll set that back up a little bit later as it gets closer to it. But we're just going to, as quickly as we can, uh, they say to not, at this point, to not disturb the eggs as much as possible. So at minimum, at maximum, once every six hours to peek in there if you really have to get in there. But all we need to do right now we did our wicking. We know the eggs are viable. So all we need to do is just to get that lid cover back a little bit and then remove the rotator. And replace the cover. So get the humidity to build back up because if you can see that it already dropped down to 40 percent humidity right away and that is why they say if you have to get in there at least six hours apart so it gets a chance to get that humidity back up to where it needs to be put everything back together and see you back at the day. and here is the view from the chicken cam what it's going to look like hopefully we'll get that on time or at least how we'd like to see it happen and that is all I have for you this time. I will be back in just a couple days, two or three days, with some hashing exciting news and some more views and see what's going on. Take care. Play it safe. Don't forget to write all your happy thoughts in your Dr. Max happy book. And I will see you very soon.